afternoon to all you stay at home people I'm uh, going stir crazy so I decided to get some stuff out and work on it went through my small collection of post vice got them out I think I'm gonna clean them up see if I can mount them I got this mounted this morning this is a, a nice sized anvil it's a it's a 150 uh, Peter Wright 1112 this is the <coughs> Smith magician that I I made for it uh, I'm sure you've seen these on uh, YouTube people show you how to make them I read a few made my own I made mine out of uh, three inch by half inch. I think most of them make them either two by half or two by three quarter or something. But I made uh, mine a little bigger, and it it, it, it helps a lot. Gives you uh, that extra hand. I'm uh, getting everything set up. Uh, I want to start doing a little forging. This is uh, the forge I just built. Got it all finished now. The uh, works pretty good. Hand operated, old antique. This is the. Got the counterweight on the ash dump. I put a my little slack tub in here. This one's kind of deep, but uh, it's what I got. Just make a lot of this stuff out of scrap, and uh, you do with what you got. One thing I did find is. Uh, Got a five gallon bucket of coal. I'm not sure what kind this is, and it's kind of large size. But I remember I, I, I think I got this 40 years ago, and I used a little, had a couple buckets left. So I may break it up a little, try uh, forging with uh, some charcoal. I'm gonna cut my guillotine tool out here because I want to uh, try to do uh, a pineapple twist got some half inch square bar and some 5 8 square bar I think I'm going to try both but it's probably the um, coal that I'm going to go with because uh, uh, using charcoal might be back to struggling and also charcoal make such a mess it's got so much uh, ash and it just gets everywhere a blacksmith shop really doesn't go with a machine shop they need to be kept separated like I'm a I'm a retired metal worker and I always welded and built stuff and you know ground it and everything and that doesn't really go with a machine shop either but since I'm stuck here at home I'm doing what I can and uh, staying busy, which uh, I guess we all, uh, we're all stuck at home, and so if we can find something to do, it'll be nice. We'll talk to you later. Leave a comment. Bye.